Let's call this step four. Now we're going to take the first mark and bring it down to the second mark. So that's that five inch mark. Now, if you don't have a pin, I hope you do, but if you don't, I guess you could use a paper clip. And then we're going to go to the next one. Now this was a three and a half inch mark, and that comes down to the one that was one inch below it, right there. We're just making little pleats is what we're doing here. So, pleats, pleats or tucks. So, then we have one more. This was the two inch mark. And I'm gonna bring that mark down to the one inch below the two inch mark that we did a little while ago. And now I've got those three tucks or pleats. The next thing I'm gonna do is the same thing on the opposite side over here. And then I'm gonna take, if I had my sewing machine, I would stitch this down at a quarter of an inch and on the original uh, pattern I sent you from John Hopkins, it um, this had been turned, but there's really no reason to turn that, so I skipped that part. So it's open here, and we're just gonna stitch down a quarter of an inch to stitch down those pleats or tucks. So that will be our next step. If you don't have a sewing machine, then you're just gonna use that hand stitch. And I like that, um, back stitch the best because it's pretty um, secure okay so next we'll show that